want to give a very special thanks to Mattel for sending some of these products to us as a gift for free. Wait! Before you get started on those stackable rooms, I think we have an improvement. What's up, doll collectors, hobbyists, fabs, and besties? Today's video takes place in our winter wonderland. I was reading the comments on our DIY wooden stackable rooms video, and one of you wanted to know if we could cut some cost by using wood from the home improvement store. And I was like, genius, we can totally replace one of the walls with these one by two inch strips. This came eight feet long and I had to cut it down to 14 inches. So I got six for $4.99. Each room will need two, so that will be $1.66 per room. But we will be removing one of the $3 walls, so we'll be saving a little under $1.50. First, I painted white. While waiting for this to dry, let's check out some holiday gift ideas from Barbie. Mattel sent us this box with a custom board game celebrating the 60th anniversary of the Barbie Dream House. The Barbie Dream House has been giving dreams a home since 1962. We're partnering with PATH to help spread joy to families in need. On your behalf, a dream house will be donated to a deserving family this holiday season. Oh, wow, that is awesome. I think this is my new favorite board game, y'all. As a special gift, Barbie sent us this unique board game where we have to be the first player to celebrate with Barbie and her friends. They included a little pink pouch and inside we have cards, Barbie accessories for play pieces, and dice. I'm gonna go with the pup. We start here, then roll the dice. Move our little pup. Oops, one more. I think this is when we pull a card. I could be wrong, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Circle of kindness. Give the player to your right a nice compliment. Keep complimenting to the right until kindness comes full circle. But it's just me. Okay, but I can still do this. Ooh, Toya. I love your nails. Aw, thank you. If you're looking for something special for the doll collector in your life, and if that's you, that's okay too. You might run across Barbie Extra on the shelves. There are quite a few different dolls to choose from. Here is doll 14 and doll 12. Doll 14 probably has one of my favorite outfits. They come with 15 styling pieces so you can mix and match. We do have full reviews for both of these on our channel. There are items for collectors of all ages, like Barbie fashionistas, a two-seater car, vroom, twins, minis, camping stuff, cutie stuff, science stuff. Look at her rocking the blue hair. Love the safety glasses, love the microscope. She has purple shoes and the jacket is separate from the dress. There are mermaids from Barbie Mermaid Power. Brooklyn is making a splash with purple wavy hair. She has a pink to yellow ombre tail with some little fins out to the side. It's a solid color in the back. And she has options. She can have a pink fin or a purple one. If you're more of a dog person rather than a fish person, here is a Barbie pet shop playset with 25 pieces, including a doll with the basic five points of articulation. There is a printed design on her dress. It is solid in the back. There is a pup on a red ribbon leash. It looks like we have some color changing elements here. There's a little pet carrier. I'm guessing this is doggy clothes, a pink plastic bandana, cat, a hamster in a wheel, and we can actually spin it. Oh, that's cute. There's a turtle. There's even turtle food and lots of accessories so we can set up our little pet area. Our planks are dry. Now I just have to remove this wall and glue in the wood strips. Yeah, 
I had to touch up some paint and now we're waiting for it to dry. In the meantime, I'm looking for some cold weather gear for Mini Toya. The fam wants to go on a winter vacay, so I need to get ready. Suitcase, check. I got my toothbrush and my toothpaste and I'm ready to hit the slopes. For selfies. Because let's be honest, athletic ability and I are totally not friends. But I still want to look the part. I have been eyeing these Barbie winter sports dolls for a minute. Then they went on sale for $16. So I was like, yeah. With this set, we can go sledding. We have a purple, pink, and gray Barbie sled. There's a waist bracket in the back to hold the doll. The included doll comes with a plastic beanie, a pink scarf, a one-piece outfit with a colorful print that goes all the way around and it opens and closes in the back. She comes with pink boots, a pair of goggles. The doll is articulated with movement at the head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, hip, and knee. This could be a look, right? What do you think? But I plan on going skiing, so... Here is Barbie with a white helmet, purple scarf, a colorful one-piece outfit, blue poles and skis. The skis fit on to white boots. The doll's foot is on an incline. She also comes with protective eyewear, an orange bottle, and yellow ice skates. I think this is my first time owning a yellow pair. I think I can use this for my thermals, but I'm gonna need another layer. I also got the snowmobile set on sale. Here's the snowmobile. It's purple and pink. We get a curvy Barbie with a purple helmet, a snowsuit that opens in the front, pink boots, a dog, two drinks, a snowman, and this looks like the same one that came in the advent calendar last year. There is a second doll. We get Barbie with a pink helmet, a watercolor print type of jacket, pink pants with an elastic waistband, blue boots, and a green Barbie snowboard. These dolls are also articulated with movement at the head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, hip, and knee. Aw, thanks for modeling the clothes. I'll take it from here. It is seven degrees outside, so I am layering up. What do you think? I couldn't get the goggles to stay on the hat, so I just used a rubber band in the back to hold it in place. I kind of love it. The ski suit fits great. I even have my thermals on underneath. Or I can go with the pants, jacket, and a scarf. Hurry and take a picture. It's cold. What about this one with the skis? Do I look the part? After a day of taking amazing pictures on the slopes, we can hang out in our new and more open stackable rooms. I'm sticking with the 11 by 14 inch rooms because that little extra bit of space does matter. By removing the sidewall and replacing it with these strips, our layout is more open. We can bring in crafts from other projects to decorate this space and keep it nice and cozy. Oh yeah, this is just what I needed after all that work. And to wrap up this video, thanks to Mattel, we now have another holiday Barbie to add to our collection. Dressed in red and looking just like Brooklyn, I am loving this holiday makeup. Red? Hold on, that gives me an idea. I can use the National Geographic Barbie clothes paired with Barbie astronaut boots. Then I can be twinning with Toya because she has a red coat and black pants. Thank you for joining us while we took a look at a few Barbie items you might see on the shelves this holiday season, redesigned our stackable rooms, and helped Mini Toya pick out some winter gear. Like, comment, share and subscribe don't forget to ring the bell and follow us on instagram at my froggy stuff the frog vlog and bella of my froggy stuff and we will see you next time bye Who cares about